Many singing tips by these singing techniques. What's up, everyone? Pow, 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 pow. Back at it again with many singing tips by these singing techniques. Today, how to build endurance for singing, how to dance and sing at the same time, how to do jumpy jumpy while singing, sing. how to do Beyonce Michael while Celine Prince. You know guys how I always ask questions that I get asked and this time my friend said How are all of these pop singers doing that? How are they singing and dancing at the same time? <laughs> now I can answer this one very well because I used to do immediate switches between breakdancing and singing and dance choreographies while singing and 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 I'm already out of breath just thinking about it <laughs> Now I know this is very extreme But sometimes, just sometimes as a singer the gig or circumstances in which you are hired require a little bit of movement. <laughs> now, obviously it doesn't necessarily have to be like a hip-hop video shoot or a crazy musical setup, but sometimes in the theater or at a wedding, you're required to, for example, walk down a hall and reach the end in a certain amount of time. Simply because it's part of the performance that the wedding or whatever includes so that everything goes the way that people want. And guess what guys, this actually turns out to be shockingly harder than you think, especially when your heart is racing because you're about to go on stage, you're about to have your cue. You're like... <sighs> oh for real guys, just pause this video real quick, get up quickly to imitate excitement, walk up and down your room and sing at the same time, a slow song. Try, try for yourself. Plus, guys, it's really not so awesome to be that stationary singer that's glued to the ground in order to be able to sing the right way, okay? Please don't be that singer, okay? <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> okay, let's get into it, guys. Well, first of all, you have to know that sports endurance is indeed very helpful for singing endurance, but it's not the same thing at all, okay? Not at all. Because while doing sports, endurance still means to be able to do the following. So not only do you have to be able to hold all of that in, but at the same time be able to control what's coming out. Meaning we not only have to exercise the ability to dance and sing, to move and sing at the same time, but also we have to train the ability of the brain, having the choreography down and the singing technique and the lyrics at the same time. You know why I always say singing belongs to extreme sports? And this is why? I recommend the following exercise. Now, depending on how much movement your upcoming performance requires, you have to decide. You can stay with exercise one, or if you have to do the Michael Jackson Beyonce thing, then just do all of the exercises. Exercise one, move, stop, sing. Move, stop, sing. Jump up and down easily like that for about 40 seconds. Then you wanna increase the time of running in place. You wanna do a minute and then sing. You want to do one and a half minutes and then sing, you want to do two minutes and sing and so on. At the same time, you want to keep your singing technique in mind, meaning avoid excessive airflow, which is obviously really hard at that moment, but that's what that exercise is about. Now we're going to slowly increase in hardness of the exercises, okay? Exercise two, walk with no arms while singing and then walk with arms while singing. So you want to walk up and down your room while leaving your hands still. I put them in my pockets like that, for example. And then while walking, you want to start singing and slowly increasing the speed of walking, okay? Outside is the best because you don't have to turn around all the time. Like in the Next, you wanna up the amp a little bit and walk while singing with swinging your arms like that, okay? Exaggerate a little bit. Number three, march in place with no arms while singing and then march in place with arms while singing. So you want to really exaggerate for this one. You wanna basically go like this. Like I said, first with no arms, like that. And you want to sing at the same time. Gonna make a change. Next to up the amp a little bit again, you want to include the arms. I'm gonna make a change. I'm gonna make a change. You're basically practicing rhythm for the choreography at the same time too. Woo, I'm out of breath already. Number four, jumping jacks while singing. Now you want to start slowly, obviously. Just do very small jumping jacks in the beginning, sing a, maybe a little faster song, and then up the game again. Big jumping jack, slow song. Now, number five, the hardest one of all, jogging while singing. Now, I know this one's really, really hard, but I guarantee you guys, if you practice this for a while, your singing endurance is going to improve so immensely that you won't believe it. 
Now, lastly, number six, eventually you want to practice your real choreography, the choreography that you have to perform on stage while singing the song. And the way to do this most efficiently is that you want to practice your dance moves super exaggerated while singing very quietly and softly. That's it guys, I hope these exercises were helpful. As usual, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to click the links for awesome musicians, fashion companions, and for more tips about singing. And if you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the bell, you know the drill. And as always, much love to everyone, stay focused on the best.